Hi, I'm Betty Patterson, President of NEA New Mexico. We have a lot of great educators in New Mexico, but even among the best, Elmo stands out. The compassion and dedication that he brings to his students every day changes their lives and their futures. I'm proud to call him one of our own, Elmo Padilla. Everywhere you go in Las Cruces, New Mexico, everyone knows Elmo Padilla. Stop in at any school, any church or agency, any housing development. They all know Mr. Padilla. Sometimes he's there to pick things up. You don't know how he did it, but he got you to donate again. But more often he's there to drop things off, to bring food and reassurance to an unemployed mom, to bring food and diapers to another mom and mom-to-be, who was staying with her school-aged children in a shelter just a week before, but whose world is now a much safer place to be, thanks to Elmo. Some kiddos that have lost their homes, it's not just about clothes to them. So Elmo always makes sure that they get some books, they get some toys that makes wherever they're going to end up like home. As a family school liaison and homeless educator for Las Cruces Public Schools, Elmo's job is to help those students who perhaps can't focus on learning right now because they don't know where their next meal is coming from or maybe where they're going to be sleeping that night. He collects donations of food and money, school supplies, clothes, anything a child and his or her family might need to be successful students and successful parents. And if they need something that hasn't been donated, well, that often comes out of Mr. Padilla's own pockets. Elmo's brother, Art, often worked by his side, recruiting migrant students from the fields and helping them overcome the obstacles that were keeping them from the classroom. Did they need shoes, new clothes? No problem for the Padilla brothers. Helping migrant and homeless students be successful is more than a job. It's a calling. Elmo began his career in 1993 as a fifth grade teacher. When no one else volunteered for after school programs, he did. He was a coach for the football team, the basketball team, and girls track team. He later moved on to the migrant education department before becoming the school system's homeless liaison. And being a liaison means helping both the students and the families in any way he can. He works with an immigration lawyer to help families sort out any issues. He coordinates with other local groups on big projects, like the back to school and holiday shopping events he's helped organize for his students. Sometimes he hears that individual students need some extra attention. Elmo and his brother Art are always there when they're needed. Graduation is always an important time in the school year, but for Elmo Padilla, Seeing a migrant child that he had recruited from the fields, or a student who had once been homeless now graduate from high school, there's no greater measure of success. Yeah.